All right, so what are we doing in this video? I have four videos here that are all landscape. And what I want to do is I want to play all of them at the same time. Um, and each of them will take a, f a fourth of the screen. And so let me show you what I mean by that. I'm going to drag all the videos to the timeline. And I want to make sure that there are separate tracks. Um, so I have one track, two track. I'm going to add two more video tracks. So it's three and four. And I'm going to drag the last two to those tracks. So what happens right now is the track that's on top the fourth track is the one that's actually showing. Um, and then underneath is all the other videos that are showing. So um, basically all these videos are playing at the same time, but only one is what you can see right now. Uh, we're going to do this thing called resizing and moving. So we're going to actually go over to the edit tab. And you can see this um, arrow down arrow key with a rectangle. If you click on that and click transform, now you have all these points here in which you can use to move or resize the video. So if you just drag your mouse around, uh, that's how you move it. If you pull one of these corner ones here, that's how you zoom in and zoom out. If you rotate this like uh, circle dial thing, that's how you rotate. And so what we're going to do is we're going to actually get this so that um, the size is around half. All right. Um, of the screen. So we're going to do this and we're going to uh, just make sure we get like what we're looking for, for this first, for this first uh, image. Now um, you can now click on the other videos and kind of do the same thing. So that was video one. Um, let's click on video two and I'm going to do the same resizing that I did with video one and I'm going to move it over. Um, sorry, let's actually go ahead and do video three because it's the next one that's visual so that we can actually see it. All right, and I'm going to open this a little bit more. Okay, cool. So uh, as you can see, that was fairly manual. Um, the other thing you can do is you can go to the inspector and you can actually change the X and Y. So you can actually like click uh, here and maybe set the value, maybe 0 0.5 instead. Um, and then I want to select the other video again, which is video four and standardize it 0 0.5. Um, so it's a little bit more standardized. Um, and yeah, we're also going to go back to this video and adjust it. So it's a little down. All right, cool. So that was a little bit manual work. Now this is a trick that's kind of nice where you can right click on the video. So if you go to video three, you can do copy and you can paste the attributes to a different video. So let's say we were dealing with video two now. I want to paste the attributes. I can do something like, um, so if you click video two and you right click or double click if you have a touchpad um, and you do paste attributes and what you can do is you can say, okay, I want just the zoom scale X and scale Y. So I'm just going to apply it. So it now has the same uh, zoom and scale uh, as the other videos. Um, so we could do the same thing here. So we can do um, Command C, okay? Or I'm just gonna show this visually because I don't really have a way to show you uh, what I'm typing right now. So copy. And then now we're gonna go to the first video, which is the one in the background, and we're gonna do paste attributes. And now you can select X and Y, so I'm just gonna do that. And now you just made it the same size. All right, and then I use my mouse to drag it around. And now if we go back to the playing, the, the way to play it, if you click play, now all these four videos are playing at the same time. And so that's, um, you know, this is something that uh, hopefully this will be helpful for you. Uh, talk to you next time.